Hello, I'm Johnny Chaffin from Collins Manufacturing, and today we're going to talk about some of the Collins Barber chairs. This particular chair is the B series of chairs. It also carries our, our it's our newest chair and carries a 10 year warranty. First thing I'm going to talk about is the pump. When you're actuating your pump, if you pull up on the treadle, that locks the chair for you to be able to do your service without the client running away from you. One notch down is neutral, that allows you to pivot the chair. And then the next step of the pump is when you're actually pumping the chair up. And then the fourth step is when you go all the way down with it and let it down. One thing to note, pushing harder on the treadle won't make the chair go down faster, it only damages the pump. Next we'll talk about the footrest. The Collins Barber chairs all come with a footrest that's designed for the client to be able to stand on it when they're getting in and out of the chair. It's important that you have the chair all the way down for the client to be able to do this though. Also it has adjustable feet on it and in the case of this chair it has the casters on it that you can adjust a little bit to fit your mat or your floor or whatever your conditions are. But do remember when a client's entering and exiting the chair it's a good idea to have control of the chair so that they won't, uh, it won't rotate while they're getting in and out. Next thing we'll discuss is the reclining mechanism. All of the Collins Barber chairs use a gas cylinder recline. It's a high pressure gas cylinder that controls the recline mechanism. They're actuated by finger pulls. Typically there's one on either side of the chair. Some of the barber chairs have it on the, this side of the back. When you're moving the actuators, well, you can feel it release the cylinder. After the cylinder releases, there's no requirement to push any harder. It won't affect the operation of the chair. You're only going to break the finger pull. If you're having trouble breaking finger pulls, you're probably just pushing too hard on it. You need to only recline it when there's someone in the chair because of the gas cylinder to be resistive to your being able to, re to recline it unless you have somebody in it. If somebody's in it, it'll just recline very easily and the chair will follow them back up whenever you get ready to set them up. Headrests on the, on the Collins Barber chairs are removable. This is so that if you have a service that doesn't require the headrest or the headrest is in the way, the other barber chairs have a knob that you adjust. This one has the push button. But to take the, the headrest out, you simply pull it off, and you can store it somewhere out of the way while you, while you do your, the service that doesn't need the headrest. So that's the Collins Barber Chair. My name is Johnny Chaffin. Thank you very much.